Well, hello, you wonderful humans, and welcome back to Timberborn, a brand new lumberjack beaver civilization builder. And uh, today, our goal is to build the grandest beaver civilization that has ever existed on Earth. And we're going to be successful. Uh, but today, we've started the stream. I've been playing a little bit um, for the past hour or so. Just trying to make a little bit of progress before we started. But we are the evening before the drought. I think we should be fine going into this drought. We've got one baby. We've got 19 adults. Uh, I'm trying to stockpile wood, but it's not going so well because I had to I had to build two new houses right here. Which each of these holds six each, uh, which is pretty nice. So we've got 12 extra housing. Um, and I built a bunch of science labs, and I'm working on a much larger storage facility. Uh, this drought, however, should not affect us as bad as they have in the past. And that's mainly because we've built a dam. A glorious dam. And this is preventing the water from uh, receding too much. And it allows us to actually survive this drought with quite a bit of water to spare, too. So things are going pretty well. Are you dead? You might be. We're going to be naming some beavers today after all of you. I think I'm going to uh, pause. I'm going to leave this pump on. I'm going to pause these two pumps and let them go to work. Which I think will be good. Uh, we've got water coming all the way out to here, which is nice. <laughs> Look at all them beavers. Yeah, we got 19 of them. Uh, so yeah, this is Hollywood, where our beavers are... I guess what we're going to end up doing is maybe keeping this as our wood building area or our wood getting area. Uh, but I really wanted to make Beaverly Hills today. And we had originally planned on maybe making this area here as Beaverly Hills. Uh, but what I wanted to do instead was if we go over this way, we can see this large canyon here. And I feel like maybe making Beaverly Hills through here would be really nice because we've got this scrapyard where we can get metal. Uh, we've got these two pond areas which we can fill up if once we unlock terraforming. And we can build a big dam here and create a rather large reservoir. So I feel like that's going to be our goal. Goal number one, unlock explosives. Goal number two, start migrating our beavers over this way and create a new district called the Beaverly Hills. And this is going to be Beaverly Hills. We'll have ponds. We'll have lush meadows. Everything is going to be great over here in Beaverly Hills. And uh, we'll be able to make a like a large dam, which I think is going to be really good for uh, for our beaver business. The drought is 4.2 days now, and I think the drought gets longer every preceding drought that we get, which is a little terrifying. Uh, but we'll see how things go. As you can see, I've uh, we're starting to reforest over there. We've got this whole area up for reforestation, and then I'm going to queue up all of this for reforestation as well uh, once this is done. And we've got all of this getting ready to be built up as well. So, making quite a bit of progress today, but thank you all for coming to hang out with me. We got Taffany, Jumpgate, Paige, RM, Yango, Mama, Herbo, Turbo, Burbolicious, Kizzy, Bell, Kayla, Paige, uh, Komodo, Marine. How are y'all doing today? Kizzy, what's going on? Can I live there? Sounds better than where I live now. Uh, things are going splendidly right now. Aside from the ever-growing droughts, I think we're going to be okay. And I think every additional food type we get makes our beavers live longer, too. Uh, so that's something we're going to focus on today as well, is getting our food upgrades. We've got 393 science right now. I'm going to make the grist mill, which will allow us to... Uh, make a new food type. Grinds wheat into flour, and then we can eventually make that flour into bread for one wheat, which is actually really, really good. Nutrition level 3 from that. Very nice. And then eventually we're going to get honey, so... Cats, get off the mixer! These freaking cats, I swear to God. They already broke it once today. Um, so yeah, I gotta figure out where to <laughs> where to put all of this. It looks like the water levels are, in fact, going down, but we should have enough water uh, for a couple days. Uh, got the game today. Good luck with your game. Aw, Super Meow. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, I'd like to know Foundation versus Timberborn. 
Uh, kind of different games, but also similar. I think, I mean, Foundation has been out a lot longer. So you have like a couple years of development there rather than this one that just released. If you're wanting a more complete game than Foundation, but this is very good as well. In different ways too, which is nice. Oh, we just got 178 wood. Oh, that's because of the maple. Get off the mixer. God, these cats. I don't know why they want the mixer to be their dancing area lately, as of today and last night, but they have been. Okay. Anyways. So yeah, we need to unlock a couple different things. We need to unlock the paper mill. And the paper mill is going to unlock the ability to make explosives. Because apparently we make explosives with paper, which is interesting. Um, I think we have to do that under landscaping. So we have to unlock the explosives factory, which turns three paper into one dynamite. And then we have to unlock the dynamite. So we need a total of a thousand, uh, basically 1300 of the science. So all of these babies that we're having right now are going to be science officers because we need a lot of big brain beavers in here, especially because we don't want our beavers to blow themselves up. So big brained beavers are mandatory. Mortal Wombat, thank you for the seven months. And your rose, uh, it's not much, but it's something happy to flaunt my yellow corgi and be part of the tag nation. Hell yeah, your rose. Thank you so much. And congrats on the yellow corgi and Mortal Wombat for the blue corgi. Jackie, how are you doing today? Paige, beavers and explosives. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lordy, Lordy, Lord. Bow, bow, bow. Can I be a nerd beaver? <laughs> yeah, I think so. We're going to start naming our beavers once we get uh, one more. Oh, we got that full. Okay, let's go ahead and enable our, our sawmill again, which we can't because we don't have water. We are actually... So, for the next... Yeah, we actually need to stock up on more water for the next drought. Like, we have water, and we're going to be fine, but the next drought is going to be even worse. So, we definitely need to improve our water storage before that happens. Just don't chew on the wires. Ah, yes. We got five babies right now. That is amazing. So many babies. So little time. Uh, so let's see here. We're definitely going to need more beaver housing. We're getting quite a bit of wood. All of this wood is going to be... This is going to be so much. That's at 40% right now. All the baby beavers. <laughs> They're really getting their groove on now. It's great. Uh, so let's see here. Let's make our grist mill. And I guess the question is, do we need... I think we still definitely need berries. We have that whole berry patch right here. Eight months already? Happy meversary tag. Aw, oh, Taffany, thank you for the eight months. Thank you very much. Thank you. I hope you're doing well. Actually, I think we can just go like this. We can turn that into a farm. Because we can always replant berries. Look at all those berries up there, too. And then Stitch, hey Tag, passed my second accounting exam today, so wanted to share the happiness. Congratulations! Hell yeah. Thank you so much for the super chat, too. I see Zaya died already. Yeah, we had a lot of deaths. We'll, we'll review our beaver names here in a second. The goal is to make sure that we name all of our beavers after members of the community. And I will do my very best. Ooh, we have 500 points already. I want to unlock the, the bakery. There we go. And I'm doing this because we need access to more food types. Food types are important in this game, ladies and gentlemen. Food types are very important. Uh, so let's actually bring this around this way with some paths. Uh, so that way we can put we can put more housing back here, but we can also put our new stuff back here too. Put a nice road through here. Uh, so let's put... If we, if we do this properly, we could put houses on top of these, which will help out a lot. Uh, so we go to food. We need a grist mill. Oh, I can't put a house on top of that. In fact, and then a bakery. 
Well, at least they fit next to each other nicely. <laughs> at the very least. Uh, but what's cool is we can actually build up quite a bit, which is really nice if we plan out the housing properly. Um, what we could do here is I could build some, some scaffolding and actually start building up the houses right here, which is exactly what I think I'm going to do. Uh, so let's get some platforms through here and we'll build it back like that and like this and like that. And that way we can start building on top of this. Hey, Yang Yango, what's going on? Chonktopia needs all the food types? You darn skippy it does. I think the only thing we're low on right now is lumber. Because we weren't able to run our lumber mill during the drought. Uh, let's go ahead and enable this again. Enable this again. We gotta unlock a larger water storage. So let's get the large water tank. Capacity 300 versus... 30. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Let's do that. Oh, baby. That is a big old barrel of water. I want to put this somewhere where I know we need more water. I'm going to put it right here, actually. We'll do that. And then what we can do is we can put a water pump right here. This is our backup reservoir. Vacay starts today. DH. Ooh. You going anywhere special or doing a, a like a stay-at-home vacation, which is kind of my favorite kinds of vacations. DH, I hope you have a great vacation. All hail the great beaver, Canada's Canada, Canada's most majestic and graceful critter. <laughs> All hail the glory of the beaver. First of their name. Beavery of goodness. Ooh, so, we need another sawmill, I think. Do we, though? I don't think we do. I think it's just because we were so far behind. I just don't want to accidentally plow through all of my wood. Ah, well, first of all, let's figure out if we can... If I do... Oh. Interesting. Wait. Can these be powered? Inspired by the legacy of Orkazu, beaver inventors are always eager to improve their timber tech. <laughs> oh my god. I think I need to improve our housing before we can have too many more babies. I don't know if this will connect to that. Or if I have to build another one because of the way I built this. New city name, Bavaria, German B Bavaria, <laughs> German beavers. That's a good one. I like that one quite a bit, actually. I'm a fan. All right, we need more lumber. Let's make a lumber yard and hope that that's not going to fit there. If I put it here, that would work. I just have to change out where the new water mill is. So we go to power. We can also get windmills too, which is seems like a pretty decent idea. We could put that there. And then we'll what we'll do. Yeah. We'll go like that. If we rotate it, we can go like that. That's better. We put a centerpiece. I love how this works. It's kind of crazy. Oh, snap. We need a scaffold like that. We got to prioritize this bad boy. I really, really like how they've built all this. It's just so freaking cool. Like the stuff that you can do. Like how freaking cool is that? Is this how it goes or does it need to go like that? I think it needs to go like that. And then we can put another lumber mill here. I think. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> I'm going to pause this one here, though. Or 
we'll put that as the lowest requirement. Jackie Lee! Thank you so much for the level up the super duper super chat. Thank you. So apparently the new faction is a lot harder. I don't know how beavers have different factions. Apparently there is. It's because these are humanoid beavers. They've taken over from humans and they've learned from their ways, but hopefully they can be better and less destructive to the world. Like at least these beavers aren't like annihilating populations of other animals yet. I'm just destroying the planet. Right, that being said, very much need this to upgrade at the very least. So prioritize that because we definitely have the wood. We have a fair amount of water as well. <laughs> Yet being the keyword, exactly. <laughs> I mean, who knows what's going to happen when Beaverly Hills gets made. I mean... <laughs> Well, to be fair, when Beaverly Hills gets made, we're turning this barren landscape into a lush forest. Like, that's pretty awesome. And we almost have enough uh, science to achieve the goals that we have set out for today, which is nice. All right, this is made, but this is not. So we need to prioritize this. 50 logs for that? Holy guacamole, Batman. Come on, my little beaver babies. Build your lumber. Build it so good. You got a blue corgi? Hell yeah, Jackie. Thank you. And Kaylee, thank you for becoming a member again. Welcome back to the community. Wait, how is this being powered right now? Did y'all see that? Am I losing my mind? Is it like somehow connected to the other power? It must be. Well, we wasted that wood a little bit. It's fine. It's all part of the plan. The great plan of Beavertopia. <gasps> we finished our large storage area. Hell yeah. So we still need books, bread, explosives. And we need gears as well. And we are definitely not ready for the Thunder Dome. Oh, we do. We need gears for that. Oh, crap. So we need a gear workshop. I guess we'll put that right there because it fits. If it fits, it sits. And we definitely need more beaver storage. So we have... One, two, three, four, five slots left for beavers. I'm a super lurker, but will you ever play Cyberpunk 2077 again? No? I mean, at least not until there's... One, the game is fixed, and two, a DLC or something, you know? There's no reason to play it right now, unfortunately. I did really actually enjoy the game, but... It was a big old mess. A big ol' mess. Uh, but Nastes, thank you so much for the super chat. And hashtag Lurkers Unite. But yeah, whenever we get one of those big actual DLCs, then yeah, we'll we'll play it again. But until then, uh, I don't see it in our future. Okay, so we need to find a new housing area. And I'm thinking maybe right here. We can just build this up for... Uh, Sweet, sweet beaver housing. Yeah. And then I wanted to make it kind of straighter, but I think we'll be okay. She's taking a nap. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I think right here is where we're going to build the next beaver house. And then maybe what we can do is we can actually build a road up this way. So that would work because that'll start getting them into uh, Be Beaverly Hills. And we'll put the gate right here. <laughs> It'll be great. Good old Beaverly Hills. 
Because we need to make a dam here anyways to lock in the water a little bit better. It technically does it itself right there, but I want to see if I can change it up a little bit. Lumber is good. Need to prioritize this before the next drought. Can we create a beaver after dark mansion run by Anastasia Beaverhausen? Wait, what? <laughs> have I done beaver monuments yet? No, I have not. I don't have them unlocked yet. It's a thousand stuff to unlock one. It's crazy. It is crazy. So these require quite a bit of, of stuff. I think what we'll do is we'll make a nice road going this way, like that. And then, how do I demolish a road? Uh, yes. Perfect. So these double housing, the way you get them built is a, is a little wonky. Actually, oh, I have a better idea. Do I, though? I don't have a better idea. I do have a better idea. I have a much... Oh, that's going to work so much better. Sorry, I had, an, I had an epiphany. So we need to have a house like that. And then a house like this. Yeah, that'll work. And then a house like this. And then a house like this. I have plans. Because the way you need to build things, so this will then butt up against this like this and they'll have a way onto these larger houses back here. Uh, it's just the way that we're going to have to upgrade it for now. But that'll be enough housing for a while. Ooh, three days until the drought. And we have, in fact, not stored enough water. I think we'll be okay, technically. But at the same time, we might not be. It depends on how long this drought is. We did not get our large water tank made. We've made a lot of progress. So this... Oh, of course this requires power. Oh, of course it does. Oh. Oh, boy. How much logs do we have? We have 210 logs. Okay. It's fine! It's fine. Drought's coming. So one of the, there's gonna have to be some poor sap <laughs> on the water wheel or on the wheel powering the gear station. I'm sorry to whosoever beaver is gonna be forced <laughs> into powering this mill. I apologize. Uh Cat Kenny, thank you so much for becoming a member. Welcome to the community. Now speaking of which, let's go ahead and get our beavers named. So we got Hiker Boss. You are going to be... You know what? Cat, you are now one of our water makers. Welcome. Live long and prosper. Then we have an age 15. We got K-Bear. Boom. I hope y'all don't die. Every time I've named a beaver in this playthrough, it has died. <laughs> then we've got Governor... Governor Beaver McBeaverson. Lord of Watertown. Alright, we need our big brain beavers here. We've got Yango. I'll do it. I could use the exercise. <laughs> oh no. Oh, you're now Yangp. Because I can't type, apparently. Then we got Mika. Oh my god, look at that name. Oh, 22. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, uh, uh, dra dragon, but you're 22 years old. You're a grandma um, beaver, and I don't suspect you're going to live very long, and I, I apologize for that. Uh, age 50? It's the oldest beaver that's ever existed. Oh, my God. All right. Grandma Jatina. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap. I didn't realize beavers could live that old. 
Oh my god, no wonder we're making so many babies. <laughs> we got Tabby over here. Tabby, thank you for the 12 months. I just now realized it's been over a year. I've been here. Thanks to everyone you've done during all the troubling times you deserve the world. Thank you, Tabby. And thank you for being a part of the community. Congratulations on 12. You got that purple Cory. You should be any day now. Thank you so much. Isn't this it a grandmother grand beaver? <laughs> the grand beaver. Oh my god, look at all this wood we're about to get. We got our big brained beavers doing big brain beaver things. We got five babies. All right, we have, we need a, a grill master. Age 35, you should live for a while. We'll go with uh, Ladius. Ladius the grill master. Tag saw the one where you were overworking everyone. So this time you're going to do the same. I'm doing good. Look, we're making really good progress this time. Okay. Like, I know I made some mistakes as an early beaver overlord. And I apologize, you know, but you got to learn. You got to kill some beavers to learn how to keep beavers alive. Uh, we got Kira, the forester, keeper of wood, protector of the realm. Giant squid. That's a weird beaver name. Giant squid. Cutter of wood. Chomper of logs. Quig... <laughs> Kig, ki, Kigumid. Oh my god, the names, the auto names. You're Rose. You're also a lumber master. Mm, and then we've got Cave. Boom. Or I could not type in there. Nailed it. All right, beavers. Do thine bidding. Wait, did we name all of our big brain beavers yet? No, we did not. These are the beavers that power the civil civil civilization. Tay. To James. The future dead beaver. Oh no! You've jinxed it, Tay! Oh no! <laughs> Kai and Tabasco. Also, thank you to everybody who came to hang out over on Twitch last night. We played a game called um, Honey, I Joined a Cult, which was a lot of fun. Absolutely ridiculous. Jumpgate, the big brained beaver. All right, point two days. We have a little bit of water and a lot of beaver. Did we? Oh, we didn't prioritize that. That was dumb. We need to prioritize both of these because we need to get them cogs. All right, how long is the drought going to be? Six days. Oh my god, the drought gets worse and worse. These god dang humans really ruined the environment. And it's only getting worse. God dang humans. Cut all that wood. Do we have another lumber yard over here? I thought I had another lumber yard over here. Only have... Ooh, God, it's so cool how this works, though. Just like how the drought comes in and just watching the water come in. Especially once we get like a big dam and like some waterfalls going and stuff. Unconnected building? Your mom's an unconnected building. Oh, that needs a connection. There we go. Get in there! Power thy wheels! <laughs> Beaver power. Who's going in there? Kahamahamahama <laughs> did. What? Go, little beaver. Make me some power. Uh, RM, I'm sorry. You're stuck on the, the beaver wheel. <laughs> RM keeps on turning. Bam, 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 bam. Caitlin, there we go. Ah. My chonky butt needs to run. Oh, no. All right, so we got six lumber. We got 207, 210 wood. Oh, sweet. That's all getting built up now. Hell yeah. I really needed the stream today. I had my first job interview since becoming disabled yesterday. I don't think it went well. Oh, Deborah. I'm sorry to hear that. 
But it's just the first one. And uh, hopefully you get a little bit more used to it. And hopefully you still end up getting the job. That'd be awesome. I wish you the best. You got this. Oh my god, Georgia. Oh no. Poor Georgia. Waking up baby blood moon like that. How many more? We have, have we have made zero gears. Oh, it's because we're waiting on planks. Oh, god dang it. This is why we need... This is why we need to start making our beaver land. Because if we fill this all up, if we if we terraform this and then get Beavertopia or Beaverly Hills getting going, then we'll be we'll have a permanent source of water. If I could be in any time period except modern, what would you be? The future, so I can go into space or see if we're all dead. <laughs> I guess. With my luck, if I went way back in time, I'd probably get frickin' uh, Black Lung or something. Oh no, my carrots. Oh, that sucks. We gotta get some water over there. Oh, that's why. That dried out real quick. For my poor beaver, maybe she... May she go out in the most epic way possible. Aww. Our beavers are growing to be really old, though. Like, we're doing pretty good. Have faith. Have faith in the power of our beavers. We can definitely build up these larger houses, though. Like that. Beautiful. So that house is six each, which is perfect. It's beautiful. And we'll build these like that. And then that should be enough for a while. Celebrating replacing my living room furniture. Ooh, nice. Very nice. I traded great couches for great couches, only this time they recline because I'm old and it's comfortable. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. I have been waiting for my new furniture for seven months, actually, now that I think about it. Seven months. I Oh, you know what we also need to make? <gasps> Watch this. We need to make some leisure area so our beavers are happier. So we got a rooftop terrace. Look at this. Boom. Ain't no party like a beaver party because a beaver party don't stop. Ain't no party like a beaver party cause Even in the drought, the beaver party does not stop. Can we name one after me, a real engineer? Oh, snap. We But we need an engineering beaver. I guess, well, Caitlin's already our gear maker. You know what? You can be in charge of the explosives when we make them. Just remind me when I make the, uh, the explosives. <laughs> uh, Comarine, thank you for the, thank you for the super chat. Thank you for your service. And Rye Victon, 72 year olds and really enjoy your content. Thank you. That means a lot. Thank you very much. And for the super chat. You got yours in less than a week? Uh, we ordered from Ashley Furniture. It's It's been a freaking nightmare, quite frankly. First time I've had a bad experience with Ashley Furniture, to be, to be fair. But a bad experience nonetheless. Oh my god, we have... Some would say we might have too many beavers. No, we don't. we definitely don't have too many beavers. We definitely have too many beavers for the amount of water we have. <laughs> that's exactly what I do. Anyways, I'm glad with that one. I won't forget. Thank you. I figured that's what you meant when, uh, 
And you said you were an engineer. Well, at least one engineer and then looking at the profile picture. I was in the military too. I know what you... I don't know how words work though, apparently. My brain is dumb. The struggle is for real. Chaos Daddy Furniture. No, the Grand Beaver Dragon. Oh my God. And you changed, <laughs> you changed your profile picture. The drought has ended and we shall live in beaver splendor for an eternity. All right, we desperately, we very nearly ran out of water. So we really need to get our explosives going, which means we can actually start purchasing this stuff. So we need to purchase the paper mill. We need to purchase uh, terraforming, landscaping. We need to purchase the explosive factory and destroys the block of terrain underneath it and triggers adjacent dynamites. Boom. Look at that. I'm going to buy all the floodgate stuff. Boom. All right. We are prepared. Wait, wait, what just happened? I had a momentary panic. I thought everybody was about to die. Are we good? I think we're good. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're fine. Just momentary panic. Oh, they haven't built the stupid stairs yet. We didn't have planks, that's why. Oh, you know what? I wonder if we can put dynamite through here and make this deeper while we while we wait to make uh, Beaverly Hills. I bet we can. So what we need to do is we need to find an area where we can make explosives. Maybe outside of Beavertopia would be a good idea. So we're going to make our paper mill over here. That looks cool. That looks really cool, actually. I like that. Super bummed. YouTube won't let me super chat an angry beaver reference. Don't know why. Dang it. Caitlin, still put it in chat, and I will make sure to read it. <laughs> Thank you so much for the super chat. Can we name one Justin Beaver in honor of you? I got you, fam. I got you. All right. We'll put Justin Beaver in here. <laughs> and then we'll put... Oh, H7. You're going to live for a while. Put Chris in here. Dynamite the river during the next drought. <gasps> That's a good idea. We should dynamite all of this and make this deeper as well. All right, so I want to prioritize this this time. So this needs all the gears. Oh, all of these need gears too. Tag, do you get the... You got that beaver fever. Oh my God. <laughs> what is even happening? <laughs> what even is life? All right, we need to make another gear shop. Boom. Look at our little beans go. They're such good beavers. Did I just get named a beaver? I hope this lives forever and causes an uprising. Whoa! Whoa! Slow your roll there, Chris! We've only just started becoming relatively successful at this game. Oh my god, go get some water. Don't be like Tiffany. Tiffany, rather. Where are you going? God, look at this. Where was that beaver? What were you doing? Definitely use the drought to explode uh, the section to make it deeper. It'll hold so much more water. Hell yeah. I think that's a pretty perfect plan until we get Beaverly Hills made. So maybe, yeah, we just need to store more water is the main thing right now. This needs to get made stat. 
as well as this. How many planks do we have? We have 31 planks. That is enough to get this made right now. Come on, my beavers. We're also full on wood almost everywhere. We need a red light district called The Dams. At least one bordello called Beaver House. <laughs> oh, God. As soon as I'm done eating dinner with my hubby, I'm buying this. This game is so good. We're only at the beginning, too. Like there's, It's going to get really crazy here, especially as the droughts get longer. God, I don't know if we're going to get dynamite before the drought, though, which is a big problem. So I guess the main thing that we're going to do is we'll put some more uh, small water tanks out just as a, as a safety net for now. We'll kind of we'll kind of fill these little gaps that we have with water tanks. Because right now we've kind of done some. That'll that'll do. Just backup plan. Backup backup plan. Water. Right, we can speed this up more. Okay. Now the question is: Is this unpowered? No, it is powered. Apparently, if you connect these like this, it powers them if they're all connected. Which is really cool, actually. As long as you have enough, you know, power being generated by whatever it's connecting to the main building. Has the big one not been built yet? No, we needed... Uh, our contracting beavers have been on a strike because of the lack of gears and the fact that we're using uh, indentured beaver tube to power one of the gear workshops. So that's a thing. You know what? Actually, I bet this will work because this game is amazing and it hasn't limited us in any way so far. And I bet we can steal power from all of this and attach it in here. And then we can get rid of our, our poor beaver that's just spending its entire life doing that. Oh, look at the look at the little beaver hangout spot. It's like, yo, dog. I'm a little baby beaver. It's adorable. God, they are banging a lot. We got seven babies. And you know what? I think we need to... They need to stop banging for a while because we're going to run out of food if we're not careful. <laughs> Let me delete this. Uh, yeah, we'll delete that right there. Then I can put roads in here. And this will allow me to put more farms in. Tag, you made Tiff and I work herself to death. May she rest in peace. I did no such thing! She forgot to drink water. It wasn't my fault. <laughs> it wasn't my fault. We got a lot of stuff to to make right now. How many gears we got? Six. Just make more food. Don't stop the party. <laughs> yeah, we are low on carrots. Oh snap! Yeah, they just plowed through all of our food. Holy crap! Qua Holy crap. All right. I'm glad I noticed that when I did. Unfortunately. Farmhouse. We'll put a farmhouse. I really don't want to put a farmhouse next to where we're about to do explosive stuff. But I don't necessarily have a choice. I know what I can do. I think. So blocks water completely. Other buildings can still be built on top. I think what we're going to do... 
We can build a dam here. So that way we can rock a walk a <laughs> rock. Actually, you know what? Let's let's not do that. Let's just build a bridge. I wanted to make a quicker route to get over here because we need another farm. I'm gonna have to do that. It's a temporary measure. Till we build a till we can put a levy in. Yeah, this is a uh, danger zone. You could make another town. Yeah, the problem is I don't have a lot of water over here. Uh, I could build up here. We could we could make this a whole other district as well. Actually, I wonder if I go with planting, and if we go into food. Wait, <laughs> crops. There we go, carrots. Just do this. That'll that'll work, yeah. That'll do, donkey. It ain't pretty, but it'll get the job done. I think you can increase the number of workers at the gear shop and plank shops. The production should increase. Oh, uh, nope. Nope. Wonder if there's anything else I can do that for. We can only... We can minus stuff, but we can't add, which is interesting. Oh, that's a nice beaver. Oh, my God. Y'all are ridiculous. All right. All of our wood piles are currently stocked to the maximum. But we are... Man, gears take a long time to make. Good God. Production, 88%. How many planks do we have? We have 28 planks in stock. I'm going to pause this. Maybe that'll put more power over here. Oh, it takes planks to make gears. Interesting. Highway to the beaver zone. <laughs> exactly. On a positive note, we have built all of our water devices. So next drought, we should be okay. Regardless of current water levels or future water levels. It gets so quiet and peaceful at night. Maybe I should put a water pump over here as well. What are we doing on carrots? Not great. Right, we need to figure out this food problem stat. So we are actually going to run out of food. How many potatoes do we have in storage? We have 123 wheat in storage. Do we have any potatoes? Y'all a bunch of potato-eating freaks. Oh my god. <laughs> Not a potato in sight. <laughs> All right. Farm it is. We got to build this now. We'll build two farms. This is going to be just farmland. Sorry I'm late. Is my apple still alive? Also, it looks like an amazing little empire going. It's getting it's getting there, apples. It is. And thank you so much for the super chat. And I believe you are still alive. I don't think you've died yet. At least not in this stream. Nobody has died yet in this stream. There's no reason 
they can't build this quickly. There we go, you beaver, beautiful beavers. You precious, precious, amazingly glorious beavers. Yet is important, yet is very important. We are about to have people starve, though, because we do not have food. Lo and behold, I upgraded housing a little too quickly. Nobody's starving yet, but it's like... These beavers need to frickin' build these houses. Farmhouses, rather. Why? Come on, my beaver babies. Come on. Just a little bit more. Yes, my precious. Let's go. Five more. Three more. God, you carried like no wood. Bro, do you even lift one log? <laughs> and then he went to bed. Oh, who was that? I will find you and I will end. Oh, we're about to be out of berries. All right. Highway to the berry zone. Whoops. Highway to the berry zone. Oh my God. I wish I could do diagonal uh, roads. It would make life so much better. Especially after the fact that you can't, like... Uh, where's the picking? Food? Yeah, berry hut. Boom. Uh, in the day he bites down trees, chews away the bark, but it really starts to work it. After it gets dark, he's got the beaver fever. Oh, oh no. Are we making beaver-themed songs now? Is this what we've become? Oh, for the love of God. There we go. All right. This building is not connected to a district. Your mom is not connected to a district. You definitely are. The problem is... Okay, so we need to make a new district. How do we do that? A hauling post. Haulers assist workers within a district in carrying goods. Greatly increases their productivity. We need to put some of those down. And we need a distribution post as well. Now that we're making more districts. A path. So we've got a district center. Why can't I put it there? What do we name this? This district area. Districts must be separated by a gate. Your stupid face. Uh, gate. Actually, can I just expand our district? Interesting. Migrate population. Oh, no. So the real question is... I just want them to be able to get over here. And this is within the district. Maybe the problem is we don't have water out here. So we'll put a water pump here. Oops. Like that. And we'll put a water storage over here. And maybe that'll allow the district to actually work over here. Let's see if that works. Since I died, Tag, I guess I'll take a nap now. Wait, you died? When did you die? Yeah, this path isn't completing because we need planks. We have planks. Uh, let's prioritize these now then. That might fix the district problems. Like that. Then we'll put a path over it. Like so. Oh. 
<laughs> Great. There we go. It's beautiful. They get like nice waterfront scenery over here. And then we need to demolish this. Gotta put a road in here. Boom. Alright. Time to pray. Lord have mercy on our beaver souls. think. Sweet. They're building it pretty quickly. We should be okay. I hope. So all of this extra stuff over here is pretty nice. has that too because we need mulberries oh shoot we're gonna die oh my god we're gonna die oh n we were doing so good can I just throw some beavers into the river there's a very solid chance we die right here I upgraded our housing too quick. Oh my god, we did store this though. We finished the large water tank. We are literally just low on gears right now. Booster, thank you for becoming a member. Welcome to the community. Welcome back, rather. This is almost done. I really hope this fixes this district problem. Oh my god, we are just... Bare oh my god, all our food's gone. That was it. Nothing left. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. No one liked my beaver song? The beaver song was beautiful. We, however, desperately need more farmers. I'm trying to figure out where I can put one. So I know this is connected to this district. So if I put this here and turn this into a farm, we should be okay. And this should stay alive, I think. Oh my god, 20 months! Hell yeah, Anu! Thank you so much! So happy to be part of this family. Tag family for the wind. Thank you, Anu. Look at that beautiful purple corgi. Gonna be a rainbow corgi soon. Really? Look at that. We're about to see so many beavers die. This is gonna be such a sad day. We got patats, we got carrots growing. Did I prioritize that? I did. We have plenty of planks. This building is not connected to any district by centers or paths. I see all the pathing. It should have connected. Got to read out their names as a sign of respect. <laughs> it's true. It's very true. All right, we got six cogs. If I can start making bread, that might be the thing that saves us, honestly. Because bread is like that wheat goes a long way and we have a ton of wheat. 
The problem is there's a... Oh! Wait, it's working! But why... It's... This one's... <laughs> this one's fine. This one's not. For some reason. I think it is the water. It is the water. Once we get this connected, I think it'll work. Come on, baby. Do your beaver goodness. If I pull this out of my ass and we live, I will do the best beaver dance that I can do. Can I be a baking beaver? <laughs> if we ever finish that... <laughs> if we ever finish it... God, we need so many gears. Everybody's going hungry. We have no gears. We have no food. Okay, I, I think I maybe spoke too soon with the happiness. <laughs> we have a total of 70. Y'all need to stop making babies. Holy guacamole, Batman. All right, who's... Y'all need to stop making babies now. Y'all are living too long and banging too much. <laughs> oh my god. One day left. Did we even get any water stored in that large tank? We did not. Oh god, we're gonna die. We're gonna both dehydrate and... Starve to death. We're doing so good. Oh, it's working. There we go. Okay. I know y'all are hungry. You can go 30 days without food, okay? It's, I know it's a long time, but you can go 30 days without food, all right? <laughs> you just gotta stay strong and not drink all of the water. This is sheer panic mode right now. <laughs> Will we survive? The main problem here is if I can just get... We need five more cogs. Just five more. Efficiency 42%. We need more power. Efficiency 100% on here. But that's about to be down to zero. They're actually filling that up now. Please, store some water. Grow some carrots. <laughs> and just start fasting. Please, stop eating everything in the middle of the night. You know what? I'm going to turn off... Do I turn off their fun? So they stop banging? I think I do. Oh, I can't turn it off. <laughs> Once you start the fun, you can't stop. <laughs> <gasps> oh, <laughs> ain't no party like a beaver party because a beaver party don't stop. Oh my god. This is bad. I need to pause all of the water pumps but one. Because if we take all the water out, then our crops won't grow and we will starve to death. Oh, too many babies. Y'all better not be banging during the drought. I swear to God. Come on. 
on, I just want to make bread. Oh my god, we need 10 gears for the bakery? What kind of bakery needs gears? You need fire? That's it. <laughs> fire in an oven. Oh my god, v Volzala died of hunger. Yavo died of hunger. Oh no, it's begun. Oh, the beaver apocalypse has begun. Oh no. Two down. 70 to go. We just need one more harvest. And we shouldn't lose that many people. I'm hoping it's only old people that are dying. Because if we get stuck with all old people that can't make any babies, then we might... The whole civilization. Three down? Oh, yeah. Tzuljin died of hunger as well. I'm glad I didn't name everybody just before this. <laughs> Alright. Should we just power through the sad times? Margaret, thank you for becoming a gold tier member. Welcome to the community. We haven't had any of our member beavers die yet. We're getting some potatoes. We've got some food. It's party time. Oh my god, three gears away from the stupid mill. You motherless goats. All right, build. Gear workshop. I'm going to put you all to work before you die, at least. <laughs> uh, we'll do that. That's planks. We still have not been able to finish the paper mill. And then we need power. But I wonder if we can learn the windmill now. So power, uh, windmill, a large windmill is gears. A regular windmill provides 120 horsepower. Beaver power? That'll do. We could build one of those bad boys and just boink it right in. Maybe? Well, I don't want to go into the one thing and then not into here. I see. Makes complete sense. That'll work. Beaver power! Because this will power both those buildings. Oh, snap, crackle, and pop. Alright. We have to start pumping out the water now. I'm going to pump here. Yeah. All right. How are these crops doing? 48%. Oh, God. 89%. Okay. Much better. Just pop in to say smash that like button. Elena, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, here we go. Oh my god, they just plowed through all the food. <laughs> you see it go up and then instantly disappear. The pepper mill is going to need power. The pepper mill? Oh, the paper mill, yeah. Yeah. Uh, the paper mill, not the pepper mill. <laughs> Dale, thank you for the super chat. Oh my god. We had Zalaji die of hunger. We had a bunch born. I really wish y'all would stop pumping out babies when everybody's dying. Actually, we can pause this. We can pause this. I really wish y'all would make some freaking gears. They like go take a snack and then make a gear and then go take a snack and then start making a gear. <laughs> What's this food at? 76%. Holy God. 
<gasps> Here we go. Oh, our precious carrots. I bet he's eating them while get, while digging them up. I would be. Oh snap! Hold on. Uh, hit. Wait. Oh no! No! Don't pause it. Oh god. I need to pause this. So we need to prioritize planting and prioritize harvesting carrots. We need to do the same thing here, because that way they will uh, plant and then we continue to grow. It's, a, it's the best way to keep getting food, because the second they dig it up, then they replant it, and it starts that growing process again. You have a constant supply of food. If you didn't have way more uh, beavers <laughs> than you should, like me. I know y'all are starving to death and also thirsty. So very thirsty. I gotta play this. Three days of drought left. Just three days left. We have a we have a nine water, six water, seven water. <laughs> oh my god, did we recover? Aside from a couple people starving. Uh, did you know I died of thirst? Oh, boy. God, this is stressful. You know the power of carrots, right? <laughs> Do I? I don't know. Two days of drought left. Beaver down, but a beaver is born. For every beaver we're, that dies, we're getting two beavers of growth. Oh god, that water supply is rough right now. We need to actually prioritize this right now. The music is very ominous. Wait, did everybody get water? <gasps> oh my god. Am I the Lord of Beavers or am I the Lord of Beavers? I still pause this somehow. Play, there we go. I don't know how... <laughs> the fact that we have come from the brink. Like, we're still not out of... Out of the woods yet. I may have spoken a little too soon. We have one day left, and then the water comes back. And then all of our power comes back. Our carrots just died. I may... Oh, please don't let me speak too soon. You just need to survive one day without water. Is that so much to ask? One day? With a little bit of water? Come on, babies. My precious. There's, there's water and carrots. Come on. And blueberries. God, this is so stressful. <laughs> Let's just look at them go. Oh my god, it's finally built. Oh, this needs power too? Son of a beached whale. How the hell am I going to get you power? Oh my god. Oh, but for realsies, how am I going to get that power? Well, regardless. Uh, let's prioritize the bakery now. Calling post, please, for distant stuff. Yeah, I know. I uh, There's a lot. The drought has ended. We have all somehow survived. Oh, please give us the precious life. Oh, my God. Yes, you beautiful, beautiful water. Oh, 
Well, no, it's not like I know how I'm going to get it water or power, but the problem is I don't have anywhere to put it to give it power. Because uh, if I put a windmill, see, like it needs to be next to it. Like, how do I? It needs to go down. So uh, transfers power up. All right. Let's go, beaver babies. Pump, pump, pump it up. All right, so we definitely need distribution. Uh, so let's see here. A hauling post. Uh, we'll put that here. Because this is pretty much where everything is. So for districts within districts and carrying goods greatly increases their productivity. So we'll do that. We have a builder's hut. Employs additional builders. Extends its range by building paths. Ooh. That's nice. Uh, we'll put one of these right here. And we gotta start building up now too. <laughs> that is the plan. We're not building out anymore. We're gonna start building up. We are stockpiling food again, which is great. We need to build a warehouse down here. Man, I really, this is where our stuff was gonna be. I need to start. And this a little bit, a smidge better. All right, we still have people very thirsty. Which means we're not pumping enough water. We have, oh, Angie died of thirst. Mika died of old age. Oh, no. And Grandma Jatina died of old age. Oh, God. And Cudhagas died of thirst. Oh, our poor babies. Okay, so we need to make explosives now. Uh, this desperately needs to get built. We need more gears, which means we need to prioritize this and prioritize this. This will get our gears going. And we do need a warehouse, uh, which I can actually put the warehouse back here, like this. And we'll build that road right through here. Like that. And then I wonder if I can put a water pump here. Ah, it almost fits. Balls. All right, we can fix that. <clears throat> they should start stocking these up soon. Yeah, we'll be good. We should be fine for the next drought. However, food situation is still bleak. Oh, it turns out windmills don't give you power very well. <laughs> Turns out, <laughs> windmills only give you power when the wind's blowing. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Christ. I'll tell you what. That there. Boom, boom. That'll get us more power. Oh, of course it's windy at night. God dang it. All right, we need more food. Stat. So we've got to figure that out. Uh, berries. These berry bushes all need to go the way of the dodo, I think. No, because we need the... We need it. <gasps> oh, my God. The bakery's made. We need to power this. All 
Uh, mark resource demolition. Yeah. I'm going to delete that and we'll put a windmill there. Will that work? We're going to find out. I don't know if that'll connect. It should. It should theoretically be possible. Okay. Once we get bread going, we are going to be much, 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 much better off. I think what I want to do is I want to get a road out here and we got to get some wheat going. Prioritize that now. So we should have plenty of gears getting made. Did you say I put a treadmill in the water? Oh my god. I did. Ugh, why'd I do that? <laughs> Whoops. That wasn't very smart of me now, was it? It's a waste of wood. You know what we can do? Let's cancel all of this. We'll turn this into a wheat field. Because we are actually really solid on wood. And if we remove all of this... Perfect. And then turn this into a wheat field for bread purposes. That'll help a lot. Because we have the farmers for it now. We can actually probably do the same thing with all of our berry bushes right there. Because they're not helping at all at this point. This needs to be destroyed already. I hear you heard weed as well. Y'all not getting high yet, okay? We still need food. And we need explosives. And I need our freaking grinding wheat. God dang flour mill working. I really prioritize. Oh, you know what? We can actually do this. We can super prioritize the wampage of this. There we go. I forgot we could bulk prioritize like that. Power windmill. A wind powered. Oh, hell yeah. That actually is going to work really well. Believe it or not. Is it not letting me do it because there's a path there? But you can't delete paths. It doesn't let you delete paths. What? Oh, mother... What? God dang it. All right, so if you can't have the mother, if you can't delete paths, you can press on the path and then delete button. Ah, thank you. That was not how I anticipated that working at all.
You can delete paths with the demolish building button. That's good to know. All right, so we're not starving to death. I'm not building any more housing until we get a large stockpile of stuff, though. I feel like that's fair. <gasps> Our paper mill is ready. Huzzah! Then we just got to get it some power. That should connect to that, and that should give it power. How are we doing on water? That's good, that's good. This is not filling up at all. But it should start filling up soon. Food and explosives? I mean, that's a pretty good priority to have in life, I think. Ooh, look at all those carrots. We just died of old age. Uh, did it? Did it? Died of old age. All right. Once we recover all of this, we're gonna name all of you because I feel like we'll be at a point to where I won't accidentally kill you all, and then uh, you'll all be named, and we'll go down in history as the greatest beavers in all of the world. Unemployed, twenty-six. Maybe what we do is if we uh, builders hut. I need that made, but that's not at a priority right now. Right, those are getting cleaned up. That's good. Once that's done, they're going to focus on this. And then we can plant more wheat. And y'all can get just bread drunk. So maybe beavers have like that syndrome where when you eat bread, it turns into beer in your stomach. And that's, that's, that's our plan. Y'all got beer bellies. I need to chop down all these trees. Why does it, is this not marked for deforestation? Oh, that, that explains a lot. Oops. Boom. The money I would save. <laughs> exactly. And this game is so good. I absolutely love this. This and Foundation has been some of my favorite games recently. We're one step closer to... Explosives. One mighty step closer. There we go, there we go, there we go. Once we start getting bread, I'll tell you what. We're going to be unfreaking stoppable Will you play more Lost and Random? Yeah, yes. I wanted to do that today, but I, I just really wanted to play more of this beaver game. <laughs> I know, I'm ridiculous. We're finally stockpiling food. All right, that has power now. Have you unlocked and tried the water dump on the areas yet? I have not yet. I'm going to actually unlock the water dump right now. So it discharges water, but how does it discharge water? Does it work like a well? Or does it have to be in the water? Like, how does that work? I guess is what I don't understand. Like, what does it dispel water from? I just, I guess I just don't understand exactly how it works. Um, but we'll figure it out. An irrigation tower. Irrigates land around it. Must be built on the ground. Okay. That seems pretty good. And then we have a depth marker, which will probably be helpful. Irrigates the land around it. And I suppose this needs to be built near the water. Yeah, so we'll definitely use that. But not right now. We have... We need explosives first. Why are 
are you hungry? Oh, it's because you're so far away from home. Oh, this got made. Boop. Look at all that wheat. So my plan right now is explosives. <laughs> it's a good plan. <laughs> the best plan. Explosives factory. Boom. Put that bad boy right there. And then what do I do with dynamite? Oh, then we literally just put dynamite down on the ground. That's cool. Okay. Prioritize that bad boy. Oh my god. Metal blocks? Oh, crap. All right, we need to go on an expedition. All the way out here. Oh my god. Shoot, we need more water. Yeah, because that's the only way to get metal. And I think that's the closest. There's that over there. Yeah, that's going to be the closest all the way over there. My god, they're gonna go out into the freaking barren lands. And we have a drought in three days. God dang it. Alright, we need to stockpile as much water as humanly possible right now. Right, where can I add more water pumps? Put one here, but there's no way to get to it. I mean, I could put some up here. Yeah, we have not stockpiled nearly enough water. Yeah. That's no bueno. On a positive note, we do... Well, we have 382 water. That'll last three days. All right, we need to build a levee like that. Wait, what does it take to make a levee? Just wood? Hell yeah. Boom. Wait, did, 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 is everybody dying again? Please don't die. That can go there. We just got to demolish these berries. We up the prioritization of this, and that'll get that all done. Hey, Erica, how are you doing today? When the levee breaks is stuck in my head. God, so then we got to figure out how to get beavers out here, which means we need to get water out here, because they won't go out here on their own. Um, and we need to... Put a metal scavenging flag out here. Scavenging flag, rather. All the way out there. <laughs> oh my god. And then we need a shredder to turn it into metal. Turns out making dynamite takes a long time. Who'd have thunk? All right, we'll put this here. This is gonna need power. And then we need, I need to put more water pumps up here. We're actually doing good on water. How productive is this? 97%, that's not bad. I really need to uh, prioritize building by haulers. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay. I think I have, I have a little bit of an idea. I was kind of thinking maybe damming this up as well. Because if we, if we build a dam there, it'll flood this. I'm going to do that. Because what we can do is we can build a floodgate. Blocks water up to an adjustable height. We can build a floodgate here. How does that work? Is the question. Construction site too far from builders. Build more past... Oh, okay. Ah, these stupid berries, man. God dang berries. And we'll prioritize layout. So what I'm thinking is if I uh, if I build a dam right here or, or a levee like right through here, this will fill up and it will flood all of this, which will green up pretty much all of this. Actually, oh, oh, maybe I don't know if it will get all the way out there, but we'll have to do something over here, too, because we might accidentally flood our whole village <laughs> okay not bad just a little dangerous is all sometimes you got to do dangerous things to have much success <laughs> these are my berries don't you be eating my berries these are my waters Beavertopia is expanding. Ooh, look at that. Stockpile and water. The In the day just before, we're finally filling up on water everywhere. We have bread, which is good. Y'all eating a lot of bread, though. All right, time to pause these. These water pumps need to be paused for now. I'm going to leave one going. I'm going to pause this one. That one stupid bush is left. You've got to be kidding me. Somebody come kill this bush. <laughs> we love the freshly baked bread. Clearly, y'all are eating the crap out of it. Seven point five days of drought. Ooh, that is scary. Pause this pump for now. I know that's a dangerous. Um, ooh, my God! Y'all are plowing through water. So about that plowing through. Or, uh, <laughs> pausing the pumps. That's not happening. Do we have anybody else die? I don't think we have had anybody else die. Seven days left. Did we actually make any paper? We did. But the problem is now we don't have any metal. And I'm definitely not sending people out here in a drought. How much food we got? We got plenty of food. Our water level is, is not doing great. I mean, it's not doing terrible, though. I think we'll make it. Wonder if there will eventually be a month-long drought. Yeah, it gets longer every time. So this is rarely where we really, really need to, like, up our game. 
with uh like right after this we really need to get more water storage and i think i figured out kind of how we're gonna do that for the most part gonna be a little dangerous but uh sometimes you gotta live dangerously right right exactly <laughs> exactly yeah that'll work and then what we can do is we can build a road or stairs up to this and then a road like so and then a road and then we need to build. I don't know how this stuff works, but we're going to figure it out. A double floodgate blocks water up to an adjustable height. Or a triple floodgate. Oh, baby. Look at that. This is where I want it. Is that where I want it? I think that's where I want it. Danger zone. Highway <laughs> to the danger zone. Because if we do that there, it should flood out pretty good. Maybe double? What, what does double look like? Double still gives us a decent amount of storage, water storage up there. I think we'll go with double just to be safe for now. This construction site is too far from builders. Build more paths or a new district. Your mom. God dang it. Oh, it's because they haven't finished our road. That's why. I assume. What are we doing on water? Water, food. Everything's great. Y'all build my road, please. He's going to need Noah and the Ark if he makes that dam. <laughs> Ye of so little faith. So little faith. This is a big, this is, this is a good plan. It's not the best plan. We're almost out of water. We got four days left. Oh, boy. That water is going to last us maybe another day. And then we have our stockpile, which is almost gone. We're about to lose some beavers. Building lacks power, I know. And then we need to build a wall here. So a one high wall should be enough. I don't think they'll build. Yeah, they won't build this until I get this. Oh, that has water. All right, construction zone. Slowly being built. Yes, thin the herd. We just had a baby. <laughs> we got three days. And a smidgen of water left. Y'all gonna need to cool your jets with the water, I'll tell you what. Are we missing planks right now? Oh my god, we are. That's why that's not being built. How many cogs do we have? We have 11. I can pause this. We don't need the gear workshops working right now. Oh, 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 oh. Down to our last bit of reserves. Two days left. I'm 
I'm pausing that pump. I'm not using that until we start losing people. I don't know if we can go two days with how much water we have left. We might be able to make it a day. This is going to be cutting it way too close. One point nine days left. <laughs> Those are some thirsty beavers. <laughs> yeah, they are. To be fair, we could use a a, a culling of some because we don't we have way too many beavers right now. So if we lost like twenty, I'd be okay with it because it would it would actually make progressing a lot easier, less stressful. So once this the builders isn't connected to any district center by paths, it is, but it's not. Because it doesn't have any water going to it. Why is this freaking bush still here? That's why this isn't connected. We have two water left. And one... Oh my god, we're going to make it. Barely, but we're going to make it. I'm going to go ahead and activate this. Big beaver keep on pumping. I could really have used this time to blow all this stuff up, though. We're doing great on food. They will survive. Whoops. We will not survive the next drought unless we fix our water situation, though. That is guaranteed. Guaranteed to not survive. But this drought, we have survived. By the levee, baby. Barely survived. We need that water coming in hot. Let's go. You are not bringing that water fast enough. Oh my god. We had Zulabar died of old age. Kai died of old age. Aw, Kai. Gone but not forgotten. You did well, Beaver. You did well. Just imagine the excitement from all the beavers right now. Just like, oh, praise Jesus. Praise Beaver Jesus. Oh, Zia Taman died of, of, uh, of death. <laughs> all right, y'all need to pump, 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 pump it up. Right, now that all of this is built, can we actually build these levees now? Uh, we were doing the double floodgate. Hmm. So we need another district. I'm going to build a district place up here. Uh, so we'll do a district gate. Wait, what? Can I not build on a road? Hold on. Those beavers are dropping. Holy crap. Yep. We lost. <laughs> we lost a lot of beavers. Oh my god. 20 of them all at once. Dropping like flies. We needed that though. We very much needed that. I'm going to pause. Pause. 
pause. It's 369. Pause. 12. It happened. We lost a beautiful beaver today. Tay, were you one of the beavers? Oh no. Oh no. That death toll. Yeah. Uh, so let's see here. Let's do a water dump. Or no. Yeah, I gotta figure out how the hell this water dump works. Discharges water. From where to where? I don't get how it works. An irrigation tower. You put it in the water. Also. I wonder if I put... I'm kind of curious if I put a... Uh, a floodgate here. If we can make it... Fill up this whole area more. I mean, it's already pretty full. Uh... Our offer got accepted on our new house. It's official. We're moving. Congratulations. That is awesome. Super happy to hear that. Hell yeah. All right. We got to figure this out. I got to figure out how things work. So this building isn't connected to any district by centers or paths. So if I click on this, this is the very extent to which we can go. Is that due to water or what? What? What is it that makes the limits is I guess what I what I need to know. I guess we do just need to build a new district. So let's do that. Uh, so this is going to be I mean this is going to be with our plan this is all going to be green anyways. Uh, so let's build a new district center. And you know what we need to delete this road is what we need to do. We will delete it here. And what we can do is we can add a gate right here. And then a new district hub here. Yeah. Right? And we can migrate some people over here. So we'll have to build some housing. But really what we need to do is we need to f finish all of this. Justice for Yango. <laughs> You'll have your justice, don't you worry. You will have your justice. There we go. We need all of that built. And then we need our double floodgate. Really? You're going to do me like that? Motherless goat. What are we going to call this city? Maybe this will be Las Vegas. This will have all the stripper beavers. That's a lot of levees. Yeah, I'm, f I'm flooding this whole area up there, though. Is the plan. And that's going to fix our water situation for the rest of forever. So this, is this too short? This might be too short. I'm glad we didn't finish building this then. Uh, we need it to be a three, we need it to be three high. But I guess we'll make another beaver district over here, which will be the district of the dam? <laughs> I don't know. We'll have to figure a name for it. Let me delete this road. We'll put another district in here. I mean, we're we're going crazy right now. District gate. Mother of donkeys. Who said you could live like that? I'll put a district. Oh, balls. Stupid mother of bushes.
we got a freaking drought coming. And y'all bushes just want to live your bushy ass life up here. All right, so we need to migrate population over here. Now let's build a house over here. We'll build a big one. We'll build it back like this. Actually, we'll build it like this. We don't need a lot of workers out here. Hey, Caroline. Thank you. Haven't super chatted in a while. Make sure you build the levees right. Take it from someone who lived through them breaking. Wait, they can break? Oh, Christ. What? That's not good. <laughs> well. Well, that'll be fun. All right, migrate population. Uh, from Hollywood, we'll migrate, uh, what, four? Four adults into District 2. And then we need to... What do we want to name this district, ladies and gentlemen? What y'all thinking? How many planks? We got tons of paper. We're going to have tons of dynamite. And the Beaver Lodge. Notre Dame. Oh my god. That's what this one will be called. That's a perfect name for it. Hell yeah. Uh, so this will be Notre Dame. <laughs> oh my god. I need this to move. But that'll do for now. <laughs> Notre Dame. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh god. Okay, so what about this one over here though? This is going to be where they start farming up metal and stuff. And so th let's build the three levees here. The, the level three triple floodgate of destiny. And then it's got to go like this. Well, pray for us. This definitely needs to be prioritized over that, though. There we go. Pittsburgh, Ironwood, the Lost Beaver, the Beaver, the Beavers of Notre Dame. Walked. I like the Notre Dame. Yeah, it's uh, it, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be great. Look at our little beaver babies. We're stockpiling food. Stockpiling water. We definitely need to stockpile more water. Actually, you know what? Let's make another giant large water tank here. I don't know if they break in game. I lived through Katrina. Oh my god, Caroline. Goodness gracious. Well, we're going to find out. That's for sure. I don't know how to get wood out here. I'm assuming it involves getting water to this. Right, we definitely got to figure out how that's going to work. Did we, did we migrate? Oh, wait. I get it. Migrate population. Uh, we want to go from Hollywood to District 2. We need four adults. Boom. Migrate. So they just go live out in the desert? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh god. Employs builders, extends its range by building paths. Okay, so we, let's build another builder's hut out here. Those, those were about to die. <laughs> Oh, God. There we go. This is what we needed. Just like that. Prioritize the ever-loving God out of this. The beavers of no... Let's turn this... 
Let's send them back to Hollywood. <laughs> oh my god. And then we can, however, uh, clean up these berries. We'll put a water pump up here. Clear that out. Up the priority of this. What we'll do is we'll send four beavers over here. Hello, Scoot. The beavers of the Lost Springs. <laughs> now, the levees are going to be good. I, I got this all planned out. It's going to work. And if it doesn't work, we'll die. It'll be great for comedic value, but I'm pretty sure it's going to work. I'm not, I'm not concerned about it. Oh, it helps if I speed it up. See if this actually gets done. So this is a builder. Then we need transportation up here too, right? Oh my god, look at those actual suspension bridges. That's cool. Paths and structures, landscaping, storage, labor. So a hauling post. I should probably make another hauling post. And then a distribution. Distributes uh, goods to other districts. There we go. Learn that, bad boy. Holy crap. That's a big ol' thing. Of course, it'll fit right there. Crap. Oh, that got built. No unemployed beavers in the district. Oh, God dang it. So this district needs storage. We need water up here is what we need. Uh, this construction is too far from builders. Build more paths in the new district. How? Oh, it's because this needs to get built first and then it'll work. I think? Maybe? I don't even know. Right, so we got to figure out how to get... What time is it? Oh my god, it's 2 o'clock. Sweet baby Jesus. Or it's it's been 2 hours, rather. It's 6 o'clock. Ah, oh, that's fine, though. Um, Alright. We definitely need a distribution system. So we have that hauling post. Haulers assist workers with the district carrying wood and things and stuff. Which we know. We have 11 babies, which will eventually be free to do stuff. Actually, if I build labor, so receives goods from other districts. We definitely need to learn that. So distribution post, ah, oh, it does fit there, but I can't I can put it right here. Oh, that works. Is that in the district? Okay, it's in this district now. There we go. Prioritize building that. And then we need to build a reception post right here. Boom. Nailed it. And we need to build a reception post here too. We'll build it. These bros need some frickin' houses. Uh, 
That's where our water pump was going to be. They're like, we got no food. <laughs> we got nothing. Oh, God. We got that. Put a water tank right there. And then, will that give food, too? Distributes goods to other districts? Yeah, so that's got to give food, too, right? Is there a way to allow beavers into other districts? Like, just as a whole? This whole district stuff is cool, but yet... Transport good between warehouses when idle. Okay. That's good. Right, we'll get this figuratated. One way or another. If not, they'll die of starvation. It'll be great. <laughs> It'll be great. Can't get all of the required materials. For why? Building progress, 75%. Come on, baby. Let's go. Build me up, buttercup. Don't you let me down. All right, there we go. Workers, five out of eight. Add a new route. What? Boom. Oh, my God. So this can have carrots, and we need to put planks and wood in here, logs. Oh wait, we can only choose one thing? What? Seriously? Oh my god. We'd put water? Oh, sweet. We can distribute water that way. Hell yeah. That's cool. Okay. I like this. It's dangerous, but I like it. This is when things start getting crazy with all this these systems. That's so cool. Helps if I connect that to a road. It's such like a complicated system. Like you can't just expand all willy nilly. So we need another drop off point. This one's going to be uh, for logs as well. We'll do log. I think that's all that that needs is logs. And then once we start getting water out here, we'll be fine. Right? <laughs> right? No unemployed beavers in the district. What, they all die? Did they all die? Oh yeah, they did. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. All right, we got to unemploy some beavers down here. <laughs> I'm a murderer. No. All right, we need more beavers. Make more babies. I'm a murderer. All right, so if I send... Let's try this again. District 2, which we haven't named yet, will send three beavers out to there. And then maybe we'll get some distribution going on? Oh, we do. There we go. We got the scrapyard getting built. We definitely need to prioritize the house. Well... Kind of need to prioritize the housing, but 
So it's then these bros' job to start bringing wood out there. There we go. There we go. Nobody's bringing water yet. Y'all just chill. Oh god, you're all, you're all gonna starve to death again, huh? I don't think this distribution system I'm setting up is working quite well. Oh, because we have nobody unemployed. God dang it. We need food. Uh, carrots? All right, we got to figure out jobs. What's this? Pause the hauling post. We'll pause that. Actually, we don't need all of this right now. It's because we lost a lot of beavers. <laughs> um, we'll pause this while those... Well, no, those just grew. That's paused. Uh, we can pause all of our wood people. Wood harvesters, or lumberjacks, rather. And that allows this to be filled up. Hopefully. There we go! Do the Lord's work, beavers! Please. For the love of God. It's nighttime, though, and our beavers are sleeping outside. And they're thirsty. <laughs> oh, they have a mighty thirst. Let's uh, migrate this population back to Hollywood for now. There we go. That's what I like to see. We'll let this all get stocked up and then we'll do it. We have substantially more storage now. We've got carrots. We've got water. Things are looking up. This is logs. <laughs> Uh, this should be self-sustaining now if we can get some carrots up in here. We'll put... Yeah, carrots. Alright, I think we're good. The time has come. Holy God. And then these needed planks and logs. So how much logs do we have there? We have quite a bit. I'm just going to let them fill up before I do anything crazy. But ladies and gentlemen, I do think we actually need to stop here. As much as I don't want to, because I'm hopelessly addicted. We have got a drought coming in hot. We've got two new districts that we're trying to build up. We, j we had just lost 20-something beavers, which was not, not our finest hour, to say the least. Um, but I think we'll be okay. We've got way more water storage than we had before, which is good. Not to say that we're using it very well, but um, things are looking up. We've made a lot of progress. We didn't get to uh, name our explosives engineer yet, but we'll have to do that next time. Uh, but thank you all so much uh, for hanging out. Can you scroll up the death lit thing first? Not yet. Um, most of it will be all unnamed. And all, we pretty much lost all of our named beavers too. Uh, but next time, we're going to finally... We're going to get our dam built. We're going to get this built. This whole area is going to become a lush forest. And uh, we'll expand our beaver empire yet again. But thank you all so much for hanging out with me. I'll 